everybody, my name is Brian Cameron, Director of Product Marketing here at New You Life, and welcome to our Hormone Health Live. You and I both have the pleasure right now of sitting down with our founder, formulator, and CEO, Alexi Goldstein, to hear about hormone health and everything that we talk about at UConn in the future. Alexi, thank you so much for being here with us today. I am extremely excited to share our story and the message of being the hormone health company. Yeah, you know what, before we dive into everything, I just wanna make sure everyone knows, tag your friends right now, tag them in the comment section to hop into this live right now, because we're gonna be talking about some really important things and maybe even a little bit about the future products that we unveiled at UConn. Don't talk too much though, not okay. too much. I'll do my best. <laughs> so Alexi, you know, we, we made a big announcement at, uh, at UConn about New Life and our future direction. I mean, you wanna re-announce that for us? Yeah, we are the hormone health company, you guys. Um, this is such a special topic. This is such a special moment where we're able to change the world by improving people's health and, and being the hormone health company actually speaks to every single person on the planet. And we will be able to share with people as we move forward about how the subject touches their health and how it relates to every person out there. I, I, I love that. So, I mean, let's dive right into that. We are the hormone health company. That, I mean, it's easy to say, everyone can repeat it with us, but, but you're gonna learn here today what that actually means in context of the company, your business, the product line, your personal health, all of those things. So, you know, on the outset, let's dive in real quick to kind of how we got here. So, you know, we're five years old. Year, years of New Year, it's coming soon. We're five years old. What got us to the point of, uh, you know, that we are the hormone health company? Of course, um, Somoderm. Somoderm started it all. Uh, my research over two days ago into hormone health period led me to this unbelievable product that I developed two decades ago for really for personal friends and family that I care about. And, and it took off from there. And, and Somoderm, and why Somoderm and how it relates and what does it mean today and how it transcends into hormone health and us being the hormone health company, it all started at that moment. As, as, as you guys may know, a lot of you guys may know uh, to date, uh, is is uh, HGH support, HGH level support comes from a product that's magical that's called Somoderm. And, and of course, HGH being the mother of all hormones mm -hmm. is, is where we started. And, and it took us so much work, uh, 20 years, 25 years with Do Your Life uh, and, and, and all the stories and all the research and, and uh, working with so many professionals to determine uh, and isolate and, and direct a clear message on who we are, what we stand behind, and revolutionizing the industry and directing ourselves to hormone health. Uh, as as Somoderm is the mother of all hormones, we're gonna be going more and more direct deep dive into the future and know how important hormones and hormone health is to every human being out there. I, I, I love this story because hormones, they really do transcend region, gender, age. I, I mean, everybody has hormones and everybody essentially will go through a period where their body stops to produce hormones, correct? Absolutely. Absolutely. Right? And so when we're talking about HGH specifically and how Somoderm can help to optimize your body's production of it, there's got to be some downstream effect of when you're either losing HGH or supporting HGH, whether or not you have Somoderm, right? You know, what, what happens to the body when you start losing you know, HGH, and it, there's gotta be a cascading effect, right? Absolutely, so w once we get into mid 20s to, to early 30s or late 20s, our body's HGH release level will start going down, plummeting, diminishing, based on, again, uh, genetics and epigenetics, right? Uh, our origin, our activity level, uh, many things play factors in, in, in the decline of HGH in the body. Once this happens, you will start witnessing your organs get a little bit more fatigued, and this is where the hormone imbalance be begins and it becomes more rapid as we age. And it's very important to address this because instead of looking at a symptom versus cause, that will help us direct and, and position uh, certain ingredients to actually support people's mechanism on balancing hormone levels. So Alexi, correct me, I, I, I really appreciate what you say there because you talked about balancing hormone levels. Correct me if I'm wrong but you don't want to just increase and max out every hormone level, do you? Absolutely not. You wanna support your body's mechanism to level hormones. You wanna support these glands that regulate hormone production. So it's not about 
dumping an excessive amount of one hormone in the body because that will cause a disaster and, uh, and, and a massive amount of side effects. And, and this is what's been happening in the industry for decades. This is what's created that, that, that part where we have to come in and actually fix a problem. So. So looking at our product line, you have Somaderm now, we have other products and the future products, which I'm so excited about. I know people out there are gonna have the question, do, are, are, are your products huge external boosts of hormones or, or how, you know, what's the scientific approach to how, um, how these products can balance your hormones? So we learned again, uh, 25 years of research, um, how Somaderm specifically affects uh, and supports balancing and regulating HGH levels is a big deal. And that transcends into every single hormone in the body. Supporting the right organs and glands to actually release those hormones naturally without introducing a massive amount of that synthetic hormone synthetically to your body. The, the best way is, is to use the best gift of that magical substance that we were given that our body produces on its own. So our job is to support those glands that improve the release of those magical hormones. And that's what controls pretty much every single action of your body. So I think our day and age is very unique. I think our diets are, I mean, it's pretty commonly known that our diets are, are decreasing in quality. There's a lot of other factors, environmental factors that, um, that I think people are exposed to more and more as, as we progress as humanity. Um, what kind of effect does this, you know, increased lifestyle or, or changed lifestyle have on the body and the hormone levels? Massive. It's, it's, your body's a machine. Um, you get, once you start getting older and you lose that amount of HGH that helps your body repair itself quickly, every single one of the things you listed actually can affect and derail uh, and, and weaken those organs that are responsible for controlling, balancing these hormones in your body. And we're living today more than ever in a high fast paced society. We are eating empty calories. We're eating white foods that don't have any substance, like the starches and the breads and uh, lack of phytonutrients. And, yeah. and we don't get enough, period, right? And, and this affects our internal organs and how they function. And with the lack of, of you know, the, the HGH component, then those organs start aging. And as they do, you will start seeing your levels of other hormones that some people may never have heard about decline or, or overbuild and not break down properly, causing massive side effects. And, and in the past, um, there hasn't been much attention to that category. The solution has always been about the symptoms, not about the cause. Yes. So now we are doing something completely different, unique, definitely something that nobody else has, has attempted on a scale like this, where we actually address this on a specific basis. I, I really love that because that was going to be my next, uh, my next question is, you know, what, what, do, what, what, what are the other approaches out there? I know, I know we have injections, which are huge external boosts, right? You have oral supplements, which are typically, then most companies you see out there, they, they're trying to address a symptom um, where I, I love your approach on addressing the causes, right? So that leads into my next question of, and I think there are a lot of people here who might be Hormones is maybe a scary word, you know, for someone who's like, ah, hormones, how do you, how do you help them understand the importance of hormones and maybe even what hormones are? <clears throat> yes. Because uh, you just so, said, you just said the word blessing. Oh, absolutely. I mean, uh, this, this can go for hours. Okay. <laughs> but <laughs> we'll try not to go for hours. I promise. <laughs> there, there's this taboo word or taboo industry with that misconception of what a hormone is. And just a gentle example you talk to a man and you say hormone and men automatically gravitate to the word testosterone testosterone every time right and and they think oh testosterone i need testosterone or i'm scared <laughs> of testosterone wait there's 49 other hormones that the human body uses other than testosterone are even more important on how testosterone works in your body and with the lack of some of these hormones testosterone won't even do its job so so learning about the other hormones will will make most men understand that, you know what? Hormones are not testosterone. They're not. There's 49 others, more important hormones that allow it to function and do its job. Same thing with, with the misconception with uh, you speak to women all over the world about, about hormones. And, and again, there's a misconception. Uh, women only relate hormones to, to, to uh, changing their feelings as they go through different parts in their Stages age, life, as, they, right? as they age, you know. Uh, 
And I'm not going to go into specific uh, uh, because this can, you know, mean a lot of things and we will discuss this at a further point. In well, we'll education. for sure have a learn module in our app about hormones and specific hormones and how they affect different body systems. For absolutely. Sure. Absolutely. And, and then also women have that misconception. It's about, it's about, for example, just menopause, right? Uh, or it's about uh, not feeling 100% well and this relates to only estrogen, yeah. right? And testosterone again, and again, it's a misconception. It's the imbalance and the fatigue, the organs that have been inside, uh, working so hard, again, based on age, diet, activity, uh, you know, all the epigenetic genetic factor matter mm -hmm. tremendously. Uh, and again, they think just of one or two hormones. And, and it's so important to create awareness after science for decades. And we, t we tend to learn that you know, science always correct, corrects itself after a few years. As we learn more, we discover more. And, and what I want to do, what we want to do here at New Life is we're going to remove that taboo from this word. We're going to make it okay to talk about hormones. And it's okay to talk about hormone health and how important hormone health is and how golden and special this gift, that little substance that we were given when we were born and how it works inside our body. And it's, it's really magical. It's really magical. And it makes a lot of sense. And, and, and it's really, it's, be, it's going to become common knowledge one day on how important hormones are in almost every single function of the human body at any age, specifically once you start aging. That, that excites me and it should excite you because I, like you just said, hormones have typically been taboo or had a negative connotation because sometimes when they're out of balance, you, you have a negative feeling or a negative effect, right? which means that when they're in balance, you have to have a positive effect, a positive balance. Um, for, for, those, for those who are joining us who are very unfamiliar with hormones, because again, this is a super unique uh, approach. No other company in the world is, is doing this approach because it's so new and it, is, it literally is on the forefront of, of science. You start seeing a lot more companies talking about hormones. I've seen a, a lot more, but it's still not, they're not fully invested fully committed they still not address, to the degree we are they still address symptoms mm -hmm. they talk about hormones but they still address symptoms and it's key not just to but the cause and what's affecting that cause to be thrown off balance so, so true so true and I, I think a good example of that is you talk about people who are who only talk about estrogen or they only talk about melatonin or serotonin no one's downstream effects of you know the entire endocrine system balance so for those who are new what is a hormone? How can I tell anyone out there without talking big science uh, what a hormone is and, and to allow them to come in and feel comfortable uh, about the word estrogen and not just relate it to something negative is huge. So I'm going to try to do it in like 60 yeah. seconds. Okay, if, if I can. And maybe, maybe, yeah. I got to get off. Maybe, maybe 120 <laughs> seconds. So, so hormones are, are little molecules, a substance that our body makes and it uses those 12 glands that we that we have and this substance is carried you know via cells and bloodstream to other cells in the body that's it now what is what do the hormones do is the hormones actually is the signaling mechanism it's actually what the instruction of it tells the cells what to do and it can be responsible for so many things including how fast you're breathing how are you thinking? If you're sad or happy or mad, how fast do you recover? Uh, I, can, I can go on this, but they're responsible for everything. Now, those 12 glands are responsible for the release and, and those 50 hormones that humans use are responsible for almost every daily function. Every, every cellular function, right? Every cellular daily function, yes. Would you agree then that, correct me if I'm wrong, hormones, you have signaling hormones, and you have an uptake site for those hormones, right? They get transparent parts of the body. So you have these messengers, basically the blueprint for how the body needs to work. Exactly it. Well said. Well okay. said. Repeat that now. Um, so when we talk about optimizing the function of hormones, how does that translate into a, a daily effect or outcome for those people who are going to be using our products or who already are? Um, a better improved feeling of well-being on a daily basis. It's all about the quality of life and how you feel every single day. And it's about how you felt 10 years ago and 15 years ago. And if we can aid those glands on, 
on uh, recovering better and supporting them to do their job a little bit better uh, by providing the right nutritional substance. Uh, this is a key, key important component of allowing your body to function in symbiosis, balance, daily balance. I, I, I can appreciate that because it, it seems like it then takes the chemical messenger is bringing the blueprint and then we're also delivering the nutrients or the building blocks so they can build the structure up. Correct, and, and, and this is where the signaling becomes functional. The right amount has to be released at the right time. The right hormones have hmm. to be broken down and metabolized at the, at the right time as well uh, to allow more hormones to come in and do their job. And, and any, any weakness between the major glands, endocrine system, can throw off everything. And, and as, as, as we get older, unfortunately, it's part of the aging process, right? Uh, so as technology improves and science improves, we learn so much about hormone health. We learn so much. And, and being at the forefront and addressing this naturally without using any uh, dangerous components like overusing hormones. You were talking earlier about uh, invasive, mm -hmm. injectable, right? Or, or those pellets that you put under your skin, those large amounts that actually can fry your organs instead of allowing your body to do its thing naturally and release the right amount, yeah. not a massive amount, uh, and, and supporting those organs to function for a long period of time, yeah. not replace the organ by introducing a foreign substance or a synthetic hormone where it prevents your organ from doing its job on its own. And this is huge in how your body recovers. And that saves other organs from, from being overworked or underworked as well. Mm -hmm. It creates that balance and harmony in every day. And, and typically, correct me if I'm wrong, with those pellets are normally just one hormone, a, a targeted hormone, right? So you're trying to supplement one thing that could be addressed from an upstream effect, right? It could be, it could be one or many hormones. It could be one to three hormones or so um, that, 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 you know, introduce that uh, emotional, temporarily yeah. symptom cover-up, not addressing a cause. You don't want that. You, we, we have become a society that seeks instant gratification. Yes. So I understand that, that initial feeling of well-being and, and you're like, okay, I want to feel great right now. I need this right now. Uh, it's detrimental long term. Uh, your organs will pay the price. Um, whatever you I mean, using, has there ever been enough. a golden bullet, a, a golden pill to take and everything's fixed? Like right in, the, right in the start. The only way to fix things is to support this Okay, machine, the natural. this magical machine, to function at an improved rate. As you age, or even when you're young, this is the goal. But to introduce, mm -hmm. introduce synthetic substances, massive amounts of hormones for instant gratification is just dangerous long term. Comple completely agree. Now, I have a couple more questions for you that I, I, I hope reflect a lot of what our viewers are, are wondering right now. And this one, going back to the chemical messengers and the nutrients coming in, does it actually matter if you deliver nutrients to a site if, you're if there's no hormones and signals coming to tell your body to use those nutrients properly? Yes and no. It can give you, again, temporary, temporary relief. But it won't fix the problem, and it won't, it won't correct uh, or support that gland and improve its function. It might give you the temporary relief we're talking about, though. So if you're seeking short-term solutions, there's millions of ways out there. But if you want to seek correcting, sustainable, sustainable, uh, daily, safety, mm -hmm. right? Non-invasive, affordable, uh, supports your body's natural function and mechanism, is definitely by far the most optimal way. I, I, I love that. And I've heard you say something to the effect of daily healthy hormones are happy, healthy hormones. Happy, healthy hormone, the hormone health company. That, I, I, I love that. Again, it speaks to everybody, um, really transcends um, a lot of you know, segmented marketplaces. It really it brings everybody together. And I love that we talk about family. That's kind of a side note. But, of course. Um, so when, now looking at our future, because if, if our products address hormone health, what does the future of the product line look like then? Oh, my God. Uh, I want to roll a minute or a second backwards, if you don't mind. Um, ignorance creates fear. So moving forward, education will, will create knowledge and removes that fear from every single person's mm -hmm. mind. 
we're talking specific, specifically about hormones and hormone health. So the first thing I want to do moving forward with our products of education is to remove that taboo feeling of, of that misconception mm -hmm. of what a hormone is, what a hormone does, and how your body naturally works with hormones and how important your glands are and how you should take care of these glands and allow them to function properly, regularly, sustainable, right, for long-term yeah. benefit um, is, is how New Your Life's future products release will be gearing towards. So this is what we're going to be addressing, education mm -hmm. about hormone health and why hormone health is so important, how it touches every single human out there and outside even humans, okay? Yeah. Even animals and even some plants, uh, but, but it's so important. So moving forward with our products and product releases, education, specifically targeting glands and, and putting together the right combinations to support proper, healthier levels of those unique hormones that your body needs depends on the specific matter. So I'm very excited. This is so big. I can't, I can't show you my level of excitement <laughs> right now, but, but this took years and years, you guys. I mean, like I said, I've been in the industry for 30 years, 25 years with, 20 years almost with Somoderm alone, five years gathering stories here at New Your Life, millions of lives changed, uh, learning more uh, with science and technology about the advancement uh, that, that, that we have discovered together and how important hormone health is and again how it touches your life personally i like what you said there because the time is is now to get over the fear of talking about hormones because people are becoming more and more open to talking about it so the time is now to remove those barriers we're going to help you with the education piece absolutely but realize that you're not only helping yourself and your own hormonal balance you're helping that of others and i can guarantee that that hormonal imbalance or certain hormonal imbalances in people's bodies have outcomes that are undesirable for them, that, that cause them issues in their life, that cause them trouble in their life. And helping somebody balance their hormones is going to go such a long way because you really are getting outside of yourself to help other people. Um, last question, last question. Um, what are you most excited about for the future? Ah. I know that's a I know that's a loaded question. One thing I can't. This is not even fair. I mean, <laughs> first of all, releasing lots of future. I call them my babies. Products that address key things that we can all benefit from together in the future, and sharing these products with you guys globally. Okay, uh, so you guys can share it with people you love and care about, and educate them a little bit more on how they can improve their health, their everyday health by protecting certain organs and, and mm -hmm. doing it naturally and safely, affordably, um, and, and uh, of course, globally. That means we won't be speaking uh, to, to a, a certain group. We'll be, we'll be talking to the whole globe. This is huge because you guys will be responsible to be the ambassadors of this message to, to create the awareness on how important it is. Hormone health, hormone health, hormone health. It's okay to talk about it. It's, it's smart to be educated more about it. And it's even more important to learn how it affects you personally. And this is where the future is going. And, and what I'm even more excited about is, is these amazing people in New Your Life, the New Your Life family, will be the first people that are able to share this education and, and future products with people all over the planet. It's so exciting. Uh, that, is, that is really, really exciting. Um, you talked about global. We have the EU coming on here soon. Europe, Europe is opening up. If you know someone in Europe, get ready and get prepared because that opportunity is there, especially as we come out new markets, new products. I, want, I wanted to mention that we just came out of Rank Mania. Right, with Rank Mania, we have seen amazing things. Thousands and thousands and thousands of people just joined New You Life. What would you say to these people that just joined New You Life that are watching this live with us right now? What would you say? Oh my God, number one, welcome to the family. Number two, congratulations on your hard work. Number three, thank you for the amazing stories that I've heard from you in the last short few weeks. Thousands of people ranking up and joining um, at all like, levels. Like literally 10,000 plus. Sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off there, but more Absolutely. than 10,000 new family members. In like what, two weeks? That's a big tree. This is a huge tree and, and uh, I ask you to be responsible 
and, and carry on the message of education. Uh, but, but what an accomplishment, right? And, and um, I'm, I'm so happy to be able to simplify you know, our, our forward message to the whole world about who we are. And it took us a long time to get to that point. Uh, we're, 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 we're about to celebrate our five year anniversary at New Life. Congratulations to, to you for being here, for your accomplishments. Welcome to the family. Millions of bottles sold, hundreds of thousands of lives changed. Millions what? of stories Millions coming of stories. to me personally that, that gives me so much energy and excitement and wants me, makes me commit to this for the rest of my life. And, and just know, I, I, I love hearing that because that reflects what you've built in a company. You've built a corporate staff that supports you and supports your business, supports your product usage. However you came into New You Life, we literally exist to support you. That's why we do lives like this. That's why we do the training videos. And we will have these training videos to help simplify the message because science can be very complicated, but we're gonna do that. Alexi, thank you so, so much for being here with us today. Um, thank you for what you've built. Do um, you have anything else you wanna add as we close? Uh, I wanna say to everybody out there, that we care, we care, we care about you. Um, uh, I, I been working on this for 30 years. It is a special opportunity that I am indebted to and there's no better reward than touching somebody's health. No better reward, there's nothing that can supersede this ever. And, and I got this internal gratification from being able to to offer this opportunity yeah. to people. And when I entered the world of New You Life and this amazing industry, I saw things go from one to millions overnight. Literally overnight. Uh, and, and this is thank you to the people. Uh, I'm honored, I'm humbled, I'm full of gratitude to, to our story together. And I'm excited beyond words to see the future. We have just touched we are on the first ladder, like I've been yeah. saying. Imagine that long ladder. We have, we're barely about to touch our first step on that ladder. We have a long journey. We have millions and millions of lives to change together. And, and this is massive. It's, a, it's an honor, it's a responsibility, uh, and, and we care about you. We're here for you. We want to support you indefinitely as much as we can on behalf of uh, myself and, and this amazing staff that surrounds me, um, we love you and, and be well. We, we, we have some very, very important things coming up here in the near future with Years of New You. So tune in for announcements about that. Um, thank you guys so much. If you have any questions for Alexi, post them in the comments. No, um, I, I, we will run into some of the questions by Alexi for sure. I know, you, I know you're gonna look at the comments section, but keep your eyes on the comments, ask your questions in the comments, and we will answer those for you because we are your partners in this journey. Again, Alexi, thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you all for joining us here today. We hope that you've learned a little bit about hormone health and the extremely, extremely bright future of New You Life. Okay, we'll talk to you guys later. Thank you so much. Thank you, everyone.